Yo, what's good my YouTube family? How y'all doing today? Guys, I hope you have a blessed Sunday, man. And we are going to be reacting to Michael Jordan's Historic Bulls mixtape for the second time. Okay, I re-reacted to the Larry Bird Ultimate mixtape. So I figure I have to re-react to the Michael Jordan's Historic Bulls mixtape as a Larry Bird fan. You know what I'm saying? So without further ado, let's get straight into it, man. To compete to, to win. That's all I live for, really. When you lose, you know, it's easily forgotten. And I don't think anyone want to go to their grades forgotten. I'm not here campaigning for the best player in the world or in history. I'm not saying that, you know, because everybody plays different, in different eras. It's all they, they talk about the Chicago Bulls is about Michael Jordan, the outstanding rookie from North Carolina. You know, coming on this level is a brand new start for me, and I have to start from the bottom and work my way up. So, uh, you know, I think the hard work is ahead of me, and I'm, I'm willing take on that, that challenge and go out and play the best I can. Ooh. Reverse layup like that? Bro, okay, it's been a while since I've reacted to this mixtape, but like, this dude, the athleticism of Michael Jordan is just like, it's next to none. It's crazy. Patrick Ewing, I remember he's in this a lot, getting dunked on. That was clean. That was a clean layup. Ooh, a little post fade. Oh. So let me know if I'm missing something here, but somebody told me that he had more contact dunks than anybody in the NBA. That's wild. Broken ankles? Okay. That man didn't even jump. He's like, nah, nah, I'm not jumping for that. I wouldn't either, if I'm being honest. He dunked on literally three people in the paint. Bro! Jordan on Bird or Bird on Jordan? Jordan. Oh. Oh, 63 points and you're looking at an all-time record. Oh, nice save. I don't know who that was. Here's the thing, bro. I really wish that Larry Bird and Michael Jordan played at their primes together because one, Larry Bird was injured during his, like, when Michael Jordan was in the league. You know what I'm saying? Like, he had that back injury that was wild. If Michael Jordan was in his prime back when Larry Bird was in his prime and they both were in their prime and they were fighting, those would be some of the best battles ever. Honestly. Like, because Bird ain't no slump, bro. Bird ain't no slump, I'll tell you that. Ooh, nice little layup right there. Yeah! By Drexler, oh! Nice little contact dunk on that one too. Okay, okay, Jordan. He lifted off. Jordan, nice little reverse. That's good stuff. That might have been a push off, Jordan. I don't know, man. Isaiah Thomas, bum. I'm not going to lie, guys. I am not an Isaiah Thomas fan. Okay, I can't be. The guy is just... I can't stand him. Oh, 
Steph Curry rage. Patrick Chewing gets stuffed because you're garbage. What you got, Jay? Okay. Oh, yeah, no, Larry Bird's hit one of those shots like that. The inbounds pass comes into Jordan. Here's Michael at the foul line. A shot on Elo. This is a fist bump, bro. That is the most iconic fist bump of all time. I'm just going to let you know now. Number one, Muggsy Bogues, I think that was. He had him spinning. MJ! Slam dunk! Ooh, oh, okay. Jordan. That was his shot, dude. Oh, crossing people up, too. Yeah, that's wild. Alien, man. Patrick Ewing again. Get ducked on. You're garbage. Jordan. Dude. This is absolutely insane. I mean, like, bro, you just can't stop him. Like, there is nothing you can do to stop this guy. I can't even imagine being, like, a defensive coordinator, if that's what they call him in basketball. Like, I can't even imagine preparing for Michael Jordan. Like, what do you do? You can't be in the paint. You can't keep him in the mid-range. Like, you can't double-team him because he's just going to drain a shot over your face or dunk it on both of them. Man. Here we are with Michael. Is there a feeling of a passing of the torch, Magic Johnson, to you? Oh, without a doubt. Everybody knew that it was coming. It's just when. When, when was he going to be ready to, to receive it and take it? And boy, did he receive it and take it. <laughs> Shout out Magic Johnson, man. I mean, his vertical was just unreal, man. It's crazy. A little behind the back pass. Okay. Whoa. He's gonna stuff it! Stuff it! Woo!
Whoa! Ewing again. Made them run into each other, bro. I miss this style of players, dude. Oh my gosh, like the old school mentality is just like, there's something about it, bro. You know, like the the old rough and rowdy, like old school players, bro. Like, come on. Now we got all these softies, man. Now we got people like Dylan Brooks. That guy would have never, I'm going to be honest, that guy, Dylan Brooks, okay, plays for the Memphis Grizzlies. That man would never last a second in the league back in the day, dude, okay, because he'd be talking trash to Mike Jordan like he did to LeBron James, like, oh, I'm not going to respect anybody until they drop 40. Mike, Larry Bird, whoever it might be, they're going to be dropping 57 on that guy just to, like, really show him, like, you suck. Honestly, and they're gonna be like no, I want I, I want Dylan Brooks like I'm guarding him. I'm doing everything They're gonna shut him down to like five points, bro Sorry end of rant that guy's just a bum Those ball fakes too, dude like Nice pass, Jordan. That was a foul. Woo! Nabbed it out of the air. is iconic dude because he missed it and then came back Look at that, the IQ to do that move is just, see but he, honestly in that one he should pass the ball out, I'm not even gonna, I'm not even gonna lie.
That's money. And once again, Bill Jackson and the Bulls say, take us home, Michael. If you have him mid-range, you might as well just, like, let him shoot an open shot. I'm going to be honest, because, like, it seems like he hits those shots better if he has someone on him, bro, and in his face, you know? I don't know. Oh, a little wraparound on Shaq. Pause. Don't get... That was a good pass right there. MJ. Oh, faked him out. That's money. All day. He's making those all day long. Should have been a tech. You can't fall for that, man. the jazz I'm not gonna lie before this continues bro their uniforms back in the day the jazzes those were fly as crap dude I mean the mountains and everything and the font and the lettering that's money if that's the last image of Michael Jordan what do you guys think you think that was a push-off let me know. Let me know if that was a push off. Man, what can you say about Michael Jordan, man, other than he's the GOAT? That's that's all you can say, you know? I mean, it sucks because I don't think... I mean, eventually they'll probably be... Nah, nah. They'll never be another Michael Jordan. That's like when people say that there's gonna be another Larry Bird or whatever, they'll never be another Larry Bird. Like, th this dude is gonna be the GOAT probably forever, but. Guys, if you enjoyed this reaction, let me know down in the comment section and we'll catch you in the next one. Bye!